Well, hello. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm good, thank you. So tell me, how are you feeling about tonight? Have you seen it yet? I have not. I'm so excited to see it. I'm coming into this with such an, like, such an excitement to see this film, and I'm so, I'm so grateful to be here. It's such an awesome night. So tell me, what have you been working on lately? So I very recently, um, my, my show released on Apple TV Plus. It's called Life by Ella. It's on Apple TV Plus. It's about a girl who's in remission for cancer and is going back to school, dealing with life, um, kind of back to her new normal after going through treatment for cancer. And it's a beautiful story. And I play Ella. And um, yeah, and I'm also working on a lot of music right now. So definitely stay tuned for that. So how did you prepare for that role? I can imagine that's pretty emotional to get in that state. What did you do to kind of get into character? Yeah, of course. So I'm a youth ambassador for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital. And I'm actually originally from Memphis, Tennessee, which is where St. Jude is based, and I, I had a few friends who were treated there for childhood cancer um, from like Memphis, like my childhood friends, and I actually was, I had the opportunity and the honor of talking with a few of them and kind of hearing about their experiences and being able to take bits and pieces of their experiences and put, put them into my character was such such an incredible thing for me able to, to be able to do. Um, we also had an amazing writer on our show who actually was, is a childhood cancer survivor. Um, and another thing that I did, which was pretty big for me, I chopped all my hair off. I'm um, growing it out right now, but I chopped it to about like here. My hair was like super long. Um, but I'm, I'm so grateful that I did that. It, it made me feel very connected to my character in a way. Um, but yeah. How was that? Talk to me through that moment when you first chopped off your hair. How how did how was the week after that, after chopping your hair off? It's a lot to get used to, especially because I've had long hair basically my entire life. Like I, I had never like even thought about cutting my hair off because I because I, I loved my long hair. But when I when I did cut it, I, I felt very connected to my character. Like I said before, like I was very grateful that I did it. It took a while to get used to for sure, and like kind of figuring out how to style it and kind of getting used to this new version of me but um, yeah I'm really grateful I love the way that it turned out I feel like I've fallen in love with it so I suit you so much oh, I appreciate that thank you and I'm not sure if you're familiar with our YouTube channel but it's called music uh, and medicine love so it. what do those words mean to you music and medicine I feel like music like is such a such a medicine especially in my life I love music I'm a, I'm a songer I'm, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a songwriter and a singer and I, I love writing music I love singing I love listening to music I feel like all of that for me is very therapeutic and kind of like a medicine for me because um, I, I, I love music awesome well thank you so much it was so nice to meet thank you, you so much. It was so nice congratulations to meet you.